Here come the athletes and their coaches. A lot of support for all the names in this final. Hugely exciting for everyone in the arena to Shooting watch on some of the best one. players on the planet Representing at Germany, work. Please welcome Felix Weisser. Felix Weisser, someone who triumphed in Nîmes Shooting on two weeks two. ago. Representing France, please welcome Thomas Chirot. Thomas Chirot of France, 24 years old, world ranked Our number World 20. Our judge for this match is Liz Perez. John, ahead of this one. How do you expect the form, at least? Not the result, of course, but the form of both these athletes to be. Both of these guys have shown they can perform in these big arenas. Obviously, two weeks ago in Nîmes, Visor shot a perfect 15 arrows to win that gold. Can he keep up that form? Can Trullo keep up if he does? Weisser will begin. Someone who beats Jonah Viltagen of the Netherlands in his semi-final. row slightly going left with his first few shots could be just adjusting to the light in this arena visor picking up where he did leave off two weeks ago expectation on this man's shoulders from the crowd and he is not disappointing in the first set a perfect three arrows from felix visor Shiro will post a 28 score. Nothing doing against Meister in the first set. As I said before, Jack, just coming into these arenas when there's spotlights coming down and around, you will get different, what they call a, a string picture of how the recurve athletes line the bowstring up against the side of the bow and sometimes it suits you sometimes it could slightly move your arrows left or right and how quickly you adjust to that can define a final can you define for us john what it feels like when you're in the type of form that felix weiser is in wow <sighs> I think if we knew that, we'd uh, be able to buy it in a bottle, wouldn't we? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, that would be uh, a sought-after potion indeed. Tomat Chiro. At the start of the second set. Weisser completely demolished his opponent Alan Remar of Croatia in the previous rounds. Six set points. Much better from Shiro. He's looking really solid. His shots are looking very controlled, but he needs to uh, put more pressure on Weisser. Yeah. 
29 for Shiro. He's there to mop up the pieces if Visor doesn't score a perfect arrow here. And it's if, which we don't even need to answer because he continues that excellence. Huge decision coming up by the judge on uh, Chirot's uh, second arrow. He needs to get that liner and make sure that uh, Visor doesn't go into a four point lead. So the measured up, successful for Tomas Shiro. Three points against one now. And the graphic will just update shortly, but share of the points in the last set. It's how good you've got to be to live with this man. Shiro looks absolutely solid. No movement hardly on his long rod. He is Nine. looking very good. I'm a bit of commentator's curse there, I apologize. <laughs> First straight oh, arrow there, yeah. But he has the fatter arrows, so he could catch that line. Nice. Opportunity for Weisser. Yeah. Hardly a flicker as he centers it again. Another two points to Weisser. That was the first time I've actually seen Weisser look slightly nervous on a shot on that second arrow then. Um, I don't know if you noticed, just saw his long rod move a little bit and he was a little longer on his shot than he had been. And John, Thomas Chiro is performing very well indeed. It's just so hard for him. I think Chiro knows that he has to shoot perfect to give himself half a chance. As we said before, two weeks ago in the Neem final, in a very similar situation, Visor shot 15 out of 15 inside that 10 ring. Five one, Felix Weiser over Toma Shiro. Start of the fourth set. Shiro needing to shoot perfectly. Smile there from Shiro, just slowing down, both of them. And as they're slowing down, they're starting just to miss the lines. Nine. 
Has Chiro done enough? Weiser hits 10. And it's an extremely strong recovery within that set. First wobbles that we've seen after the measures. We'll see if that's enough for the gold medal. Weiser really looked like he was struggling to get over the line on that end just uh, after he finally missed a, a 10 he just kind of lost his way a bit but did enough just to find himself over the line Felix Weister almost completely composed throughout this final when he showed a small crack, he still had the metal to get the gold. So Felix Weisser overcomes Tomat Shiro. And he has another gold medal. It is the Indoor World Series, which he has wrapped up comprehensively so after his victory in Nîmes.